Hey guys and gals, how we doing? It's me, Joe Sires, back here for the Music Factory Studios. I know it's been a while. I've been really busy. I've actually got some time off, and I'm on vacation, so I might put out a few videos here over the next week or so. But uh, here's something, a quick tip for everybody. I didn't really know this myself until just a minute ago when I just so happened to be looking at the quick help over here that you see on the top left of Logic. And I was like, you know, I really don't know a whole lot about Chromaverb, but I'd like to know a little bit more. And I thought, do I still have those in Apple Books, the the manuals for like all of the Logic instruments and effects and, and whatnot? And then I remembered, if you hold Command and Backspace, right, while you're in Logic, Command Backspace, while you've got a plugin open, or where it says for more info, just get to a place where it says more info. See here, it says Peak Level Display. Hit command backspace now what I was looking to do was find out some more information on chromaverb right so what I did was set it over top of one of the plugins and went command backspace and this little window pops up and it'll say add remove copy plugins or whatever but if you scroll on down you can download the Apple Pro Apple Logic Pro user guide either in Apple Books form or PDF. So if you just click on, say, PDF for effects, there we go. It'll open up Logic's effects in a PDF, and you can just download it by clicking the little button here if you're in a Chrome browser. You can get the one for instruments and the full user guide as well, which is a pretty big PDF, by the way. And uh, if you really are interested in these things, you can read through and, and start to learn about everything in Logic and familiarize yourself with it. RTFM, trust me, <laughs> for all my Linux uh, uh, watchers of the channel, they'll know what RTFM means. It's read the effing manual. But uh, I, I would recommend at least checking out some of the, your favorite effects that are in Logic and uh, some of your favorite uh, things to do in Logic, such as um, the interesting things about tuning vocals in uh, flex time and flex pitch. Those are really interesting to learn about. So, just thought I'd let you know. Basically, go into Logic, put your mouse over one of the effects, and hit Command Backspace, and your little window will pop up. If you get lost in anything in Logic, right? So, like, you're up here on the transport. You can hit Command backspace and a window will pop up as long as you're connected to the inter internet and it will tell you about the thing your mouse was over right so let's see about oh i don't know level meters again right command backspace or command question mark button okay and here you've got in the window about peak level meters and how to avoid clipping and and the whole nine yards and that's really really handy and any of them actually should give you this option down here to get the pdfs or you can have it in your apple books uh, in the books app which is really nice so there's a lot of good information if you don't want to read the whole manual and you just want to check out certain things you may not know like the solo button <clears throat> excuse me and how to you know do things such as solo and mute and solo safes and whatnot that's all right here so just put your mouse over it whatever you want to learn about and you know the input slot command question mark and it'll give you that part of the manual immediately all right guys and gals i hope this helped if it did thumbs up subscribe for more awesome content here on the music factory studios all right guys and gals we'll see you next time have a great day y'all